We can do one of two things because I, I want you to understand I spent a fair amount of time talking to them and they love you enough to allow you to have whatever consequences come with whatever behaviors you choose. You're under arrest now. They bailed you out so you could come here. Um, and you can go back and they can revoke that bail and you can go right back to jail. And they have agreed to not get you a lawyer, to not bail you out, to let you get your sentence for a third DUI and sit in jail if it's two years, three years, whatever that they're not going to intercede and keep you from suffering consequences. Or you can do what I want you to do. I'd rather do what you want. Well, you don't even know what it is yet. <laughs> <laughs> you don't even know what it is yet. Um, what I want you to do, because I'm the incurable optimist, and I think I don't ever give up on people, and I'm not giving up on you. I think you can get, I think you can beat this. I think you can get back to being happy. I think you can get back to being a grandma where those kids are climbing up in your lap and putting their arms around your neck. And I think they are prepared to forgive you forevermore when you stop doing what you're doing. And this man right here, T.J. Howard, raise your hand. Say hello to T.J. Howard right here. T.J. Howard is the Corporate Director of Operations for the Origins Behavioral Health Care. Now, let me tell you, they're not a rehab center. They're a dual diagnosis treatment center. And what that means is they treat the entire individual. Alcohol abuse, drug abuse, seldom happens in a vacuum. It usually happens in parallel with psychological issues at the same time. They treat those problems and the addiction problems at the same time. TJ, we've talked about this. You believe you can help this woman, true? Yeah, absolutely. I think the struggles with alcohol and the, the opiates from years and years ago have definitely changed your brain, and that's what we do. We work to help develop new pathways, new ways to you know, go at life. But I know you've gone before and you've gotten out and gone right back to drinking. And when I get involved, have you ever watched this show before? All the time. I, enjoy, I really like you a lot. Yeah. <laughs> Good. I think you're great. Well, you know that when I get involved, I get involved. I know you do. I'm, I'm going to ask you to agree to a behavioral contract. I, Lisa, agree that in accepting rehabilitative services offered by Origins Behavioral Recovery Center will fully comply with their curriculum and remain in the program until such time as they deem it appropriate for me to be released. Upon release, I agree I will immediately wear a monitoring ankle bracelet 24 hours a day, seven days a week. And what it does it monitors alcohol content in your body by a transdermal sensor. Mm -hmm. And if you drink, it transmits that alcohol level to that bracelet, records that data, and that data is going to be transmitted to your family and to Origins, and they're going to take that data and send it straight to your probation or your parole officer. I've got a parole officer. You will, because you've just had a third DUI. Wow. Wow. Thank you. So, is that your choice? Yes, sir. This, um, this, requires, this requires that you sign this, which means you're agreeing that you're gonna turn her in if she violates this. Will you sign your copy right there? You need to sign it right there. I'll let you sign it right there. It's time to be accountable. Deal? <laughs>